put your hands together for Noah Shark Robertson. We don't take too kindly to your kind around these kinds of parts. Check me out. uh, You know you're supposed to play with your drumsticks, not eat them, right? (laughs) (laughs) Damn. (laughs) Says the guy dressed like a princess. Whoa. I think I know what that means. Drum up. Here he is, ladies and gentlemen. Noah Shark Robertson. It's a Mexican drum up. Oh, wow. Real fucking friendly. I, I realized I had to get the fuck out of there quickly. I packed my drums and my clothes in my car and I moved to Hollywood. You know, it, it actually ended up working out really well for me. I ended up signing record deals, touring the world, got on the billboard charts. And uh, yeah, I've been, do- I've been taking a little short break from music. Uh, I've been doing the Uber driving. So you can tell I have a lot going on for me, you know? Uh, musician, stand-up comedy, Uber. Uh, one of the other cool things I've been doing lately is uh, living in my car. Which, it doesn't really help when you're trying to meet ladies, you know? Like, I'll meet a chick at a bar, what do you do? And I'm just like, I work from home. <laughs> so, one of the annoying things about uh, doing the Uber is uh, people can rate you. And I didn't realize that until, you know, rating popped up on my phone uh, a couple days in. Ding! You're an idiot. And uh, this guy gave me a two-star rating, and he was like, well, he was an okay driver, but the conversation could have been better. <laughs> what the fuck? You don't even own a car, you dick. <laughs> so, so, <laughs> so I started doing it back to them. I realized as a driver, you can rate them. So I gave this guy a one-star rating, and I was like, he was an okay passenger, but he had a weird hat on. <laughs> Just a dumb face. <laughs> So uh, another thing that happened, there was this 90-year-old couple that got in my car, I swear to God, they were like farting dust as they got in the car, and they couldn't figure out how to technology at all, they were fucking up the app, they were blaming me the whole time, I got into a slight argument with them, and I swear to God, this 100-year-old man turns to me in the middle of the argument, and he goes, son, I've been using Uber my whole life! <laughs> and then when you're in the service industry, you can't say, like, what you're thinking. Like, I wanted to be like, I'm sorry, sir, I didn't realize that you were beta testing Uber since they were crank starting cars. That's, that's interesting information. Ask somebody for directions in California, and they're like, yeah, just jet down to 405, and that'll shoot you out to Arroyo Canyon, bro. And then you just, you just hop on the 101, and that'll fucking blast you down into a fucking arena. Yeah, come sit next to me, Zane. Uh, do I have to? You smell a little bit. I <laughs> know, oh, it's the heroin. <laughs> it is the heroin. This guy knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> and I got out of my car and I was like, Dad, it's me. I, I'm just kidding. I've never met my biological father. I'm literally a bastard. Uh, <laughs> Last but not least. Oh, the wheel. Oh, what I'm doing, you fucks. Shut up. Okay? I actually didn't forget. Thank you. Dicks! 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 And I got fucked! Shit. Cheers. Am I drinking and driving? Hell yeah, free country, ain't it? Oh shit! Brought to you by Rockdale. That's smooth. They cause cancer, diarrhea, anal bleeding, or death.